It's Thursday, so let's eat. Are you ready for some comfort food? We've got what you're looking for at an upstate pub. 7 News' is Christine Scarpelli is live with the Hare and the Hound morning. in Landrum. Good morning. Yes, absolutely. Landrum cannot wait to have you this weekend or come maybe today. We've mm -hmm. got Chef Sean Shaw with us this morning. We are here at Hare and Hound. It is a great pub. They love comfort food. I'm going to show you just a little bit and then we'll talk to them after this. This pub has been here for decades and entices locals and visitors alike with warm comfort food, some wild game features, even something for the really sophisticated palate. Hey, you want to know where I come to eat with my friends? It's here in Landrum at the Hare and the Hound. It started off small and then it's just grown exponentially over the years. 25 years, in fact, and service manager Farrell Atkins has been at the restaurant for half and in the area for even longer. That's how he knows fun facts like... As a kid, was it was a uh, drugstore and five and ten type store. And the uh, bar downstairs, if you take close notice of it, is actually still the pharmacy counter. Just like Atkins, many of those local families still stop in. And after sampling Chef Sean Shell's decadent twist on some classic favorites, we can taste why. We probably sell about 90 gallons of Guinness beef stew every week. Carrots, onions, celery, and of course the star of the dish. The Guinness gives it its wonderful flavor. Mashed potatoes are whipped and piped on. We recommend if you're really looking to settle in, convince your dining partner to try the chicken pot pie. It's a mixture of heavy cream, mushrooms, carrots, celery, onion, chicken, chicken stock, and it's thickened with a root. We use a flaky puff pastry crust for the top of our pot pie. We make it in the shape of a pinwheel. Chef Shell chooses fresh ingredients to create a handful of seasonal specials that change daily. When we stopped in, it was stuffed corn husk with seared snapper. For our stuffing for our corn husk, I start off with just a little bit of purple onion, diced celery, cumin, chili powder. These are baby shrimp already peeled and ready to go. It's a wild rice, and what I'm going to do is open this up, put this right in the corn. And this is almost like a tamale. If that isn't enough, yeah, trust the chef to serve you something new. And then just eat it like a chicken wing? Eat it like a chicken wing. Oh gosh, oh, the onion. Frog legs, who would have ever, ever thought? Unbelievable. Mm -hmm. When you put something that's amazing in front of somebody, you just get that wow effect. So we always try to put some wow effect in our food. From the family at the Hare and the Hound in Landrum, we say, let's eat. <laughs> So very good. That's right. Okay, Hare and Hound in Landrum is open seven days a week. They are truly a restaurant that is going to accommodate you or your family. Chef Sean Shell, my gosh, you've been here for how many years? I've been here about 14 years. 14, and the whole place has been open how long? Uh, 19 years. Which is incredible. Yep. Mm -hmm. Hare and Hound focuses on comfort food. You guys do specials mm -hmm. when? We do specials nightly, and then we also have uh, specials that we run on the weekends. Uh, ribs and prime rib being two of the more popular ones. I'll say, how about it? Yeah, and it's cold outside. What a great way to start off the new year. What days are you open? We are open seven days a week, 11 o'clock to 10 o'clock. 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Come out and visit them, guys. What'd you think? I think it looks awesome. I can't wait to hear more. Thank you, Christine. Yeah. Exactly.